Canadian excellence was on display in Hamilton today. The first and only all-Canadian electric vehicle made from Hamilton Steel rolled into town today. And as Laverne McGee tells us, local students got a first-hand look at Project Arrow. Project Arrow, an all-electric autonomous vehicle, zero emissions, 100% made in Canada, price tag $20 million, possibilities endless. That was the message to St. John Brebeuf High School students who got a visit from Project Arrow, a prototype. It's hoped that teens like grade 12 student Desmond Burge will be inspired to help transform Canada's automotive sector. The part of the car I'm interested in the most in would probably be the uh, lithium batteries that it's got in it. Flavio Volpe, president of the Automotive Parts Manufacturers Association, oversees Project Aero. It goes up to 180 kilometers an hour. The range is 500 kilometers per charge. The steering wheel has a sensor that can detect if you're having a heart attack and drive you to the hospital. And that's not all. Just like Team Canada hockey team usually puts a loony under a center ice uh, before the Olympics, we put a center court stripe on a hardwood floor as a tribute to the, to the Raptors championship because this car was originated, this idea came up when they were the defending champions. That is awesome. And there's, there's Hamilton Steel in this car, right? Yeah, we're a big partner with uh, ArcelorMittal DeFasco. Also, the windshield is from Oakville and interior panels were manufactured by a 71-year-old Hamilton company. The panels that are actually on the dashboard, all the panels that are on the door, all the panels that are on the console, everything that you see inside of that vehicle in the interior, with the exception of the seats, were manufactured by Felfab. Right here in Hamilton? Right here in Hamilton. The wheels on Project Aero not only look cool, they're designed to give you more range because they're lightweight and aerodynamic. Minister Philomena Tassi, responsible for the Federal Economic Development Agency for Southern Ontario, says the $5.4 million they spent will hopefully inspire high school and college students to be a part of this emerging industry. Ontario Tech is here. Some of those students actually put the car together. It's up to students like these to take Canada's electric vehicle industry to the next level. Burge is all in. He plans on attending Niagara College for the Electronic Vehicle Technician Program. Down the road, I would love to uh, get into electric vehicles and even possibly help make one down the future. Laverne McGee, CHCH News.